Hello everybody, Joe Tactical here again. I'm going to do a little flashlight review. Now this is on the Streamlight Stylus Pro. Basically this runs off two AAA batteries and I believe has 25 lumens. And if I find that to be wrong, I will try to remember to annotate it. Um, this is the Maglite LED, and I believe this is 15 lumens. And this runs on two double A's. Now, in a lot of ways, the Streamlight Stylus Pro is far superior. But there's a lot to be said about the Maglite AA LED. Okay, now... The ones with, without the LED, they're good, but not quite as good. Now, you know, I know, and I myself am, am a somewhat flashaholic just learning about the technology. There's so many people that know far more than I do. But um, I understand, you know, like, like I have the, uh, the Quark Turbo 123, the Quark Turbo Squared 4.7s, on my uh, Stag Arms M4. Okay, so I understand about the upcoming technology and I fully respect it. But there's a lot to be said about a uh, good quality mag light with a decent LED. Okay, does it have artifacts in the uh, the beam? Sure. Does it have, uh, you know, kind of like uh, the halo rings and whatever you want to call it or whatever? Sure. When it's dark, and I need to see, does it enable me to be able to see? Yes. Okay, so if you want to shine two lights on a wall and compare one to the other, then that's all well and good. But if you just need a light to see, then more or less every light's going to do it for you, depending on the situation. And trust me, I, I love the new flashlight technology. The Streamlight Stylus Pro is an awesome light. And as far as weight, size, smaller batteries, brighter light, uh, the convenience of it and everything, I got this little lanyard kind of rigged up here for now. I don't really know how that's going to end up being done, but I have a couple of these. Every every time I'm somewhere and I kind of see one for sale for like 15 or 20 bucks or whatever, I have a tendency to pick it up if I got a little extra money in my pocket. But um, I'm going to turn this light off now, and please bear with me for just a second. It will be dark, but it, it you will see light shortly after. This here is the mag light. Okay, nothing, uh, nothing major about it, but you can see, oh, here's this light. Well, I can get that. Okay, now let me uh, show you this. Of course, this is a nice beam. That's, I mean, that there's no comparison between the two. And you see, there's the, and these batteries might not be 100% in either of these, but there is the Mag Light, there's the Stylus Pro, together, just the Mag Light, together, just the Stylus Pro. And I'm going to turn this light back on. Now, something that I find to be helpful. If you have an item in your kit, especially, I see a lot of guys using this as an EDC uh, light, and it's perfect for that. I mean, that's its intended purpose, I believe, and it's a great light. It's small enough. You can put it anywhere. Put one in your tackle box, your toolbox, your pocket, you know. I mean, any type of bag or kit you got, throw a Stylus Pro in there. It's light enough, and it's a light, an extra light, whatever. Okay, now, for EDC, I like to have, and I know this is going to be counterproductive, but I like to have a light with a little bit of substance to it. When you hold this in one hand, even though it's bigger and heavier, and you hold this in the other hand, this seems kind of anorexic and frail. And basically, if this fell from 10 feet, and I don't know, and I don't want to scratch up my light, not that I don't mind it getting worn, but I just don't want to abuse my light because I'm on a limited budget. Um, I don't think this would handle what this can handle because this is like a tank and this is kind of like a Hummer. You know, a Hummer is well uh, protected, but this is a tank. I'd rather be in this. If you had to use this in a defensive role against an armed bad guy meaning to do you harm, this would excel. 
you can get a good grip on that head and you could shove this in an armpit to push them away from from you and then you get the heck out of there okay where this I mean you know it's like a big pen now granted the pen can be uh, mightier than the sword if used properly but uh, I'd still rather have the sword but um, you know it just kind of seems kind of weak and I'm not just saying hey you just want this for a defensive tool no that's not it it just seems like a more durable light I've got gashes and scrapes and I've carried this for about four years actually maybe a little bit longer than four years now and um, it's it's excellent would this hold up as good as that I don't know but just feeling the two I would say that the mag light would dominate it but the Streamlight Stylus Pro for an EDC light being lightweight, compact, brighter than the LED mag light would definitely be far superior. And for most uses, I would say go with the Streamlight Stylus Pro for all the, the facts that I just mentioned. But um, again, you know, I'm kind of old school, I guess, and it's hard to let go of the mag lights, even though I have a 4 sevens Quark Turbo Double A on its way or I don't know what's going on there's there's some problem with four sevens um, and also let me touch base on that as well four sevens will only ship you a light uh, first class mail and that's kind of a problem because you can't track it nobody really knows where it goes I had uh, I spent about 80 bucks and had that light shipped to me and there was some problems the post office said I received it I asked my neighbors if they received it they said no so I'm waiting on on that but um, with, with that aside four sevens the the quark turbo double a squared is also a substantial size light and that's what I like to have for an EDC and also this if this slips out somewhere I'm not really gonna feel it if it slips out of the cheesy little pouch that it comes in or or whatever and I could lose that and I don't want to lose any piece of gear because that's why I carry it because I need it so I mean you know but uh, with all that aside if you especially like women or something like that if you need an EDC, EDC light and you have a purse or, or men that carry bags around or whatever this would be perfect to have zipped up in, in an enclosed pouch or something like that definitely the Streamlight Stylus Pro would be the way to go and uh, with that, I'm Joe Tactical. Hope you guys got something good from my video. Thanks always for watching. Subscribe if you want, but if you don't want to, that's fine. I'm just glad you guys are watching. Joe Tactical out.